how to use Google Sites to make a portfolio easy. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So for today's video, if you're looking for a free website builder to create your portfolio website, then this video is perfect for you. So without further ado, let's get started. So first thing first, you need to visit sites.google.com and this is the homepage where you can create your own website. So here you have two options to start with, blank website or you can also start with templates. So over here, you can see the templates that you can make use of and to see more, you just need to click here to expand your option. But for today, I will go ahead and select this portfolio over here to start our website design. And after that, it will redirect me to this page where I can edit my own website page. So as you can see here, this website is almost ready. So you just need to change everything here. So first, I will just remove everything here so you can remove this one. So you have your delete button here, so just click on it. So I will delete this one as well. And here you can do a lot of things. You just need to select the blocks here and sections over here. So for example, I will be adding this three images with text over here. I will just click on it and it will be added here inside my website. So that's how easy you can add some blocks inside your website and also you can add some other section here, like for example, table of contents, image carousel, button, divider, YouTube, calendar, mop. And also, as you can see here from our template, we already have three pages here, which is the about and the project page. So you can also add more pages here. So just click this pages over here. Just click this add icon down here and you have your add new page or you can also add a new link or you can add new menu section depends on you and also we can change the theme of our website over here so we have different themes here that you can make use of for example we have now from simple we can also change it to aristotle for example i will also choose diplomat here vision all right, so let me just go ahead and keep this diplomat. I like this one. And then what we can do here is that we can change this one. So just click on it. And then I will just go ahead and delete the text here. And I will add my information here. And then over here, we can also change our name over here. So let me just uh, put it here, Keith Portfolio. So guys, if you have your own logo for your portfolio, then you can add your logo here instead. So just click add logo and then you can upload your logo here. And then you can also add header here. So what is header? So let's just click on it and this will be your header if you like to add header in your website. But I will just remove this one. And the next thing that we can do is change the photo over here. So to change the photo, you just need to click on it and you can see a three dots here. So just click on three dots and here you have your option to replace the image. So you just need to upload your own image and make sure that your image is high quality. It's good looking image and it looks professional. So I will just skip this one because I don't have photo for this. And then the next thing that we can do here is to add more information in our homepage. So this is our homepage. So here I will just delete this one also. And then here I will just enter about me. You can also provide information here, just a short description about yourself. So let me just go ahead and select this block here. So let me just move this one up. So to move this one up and you can just click your mouse and hold it and then drag it up to move this one and then just drop it. So that's how easy you can move your sections here or your blocks here and arrange everything. So let me just go ahead and delete this other section. All right, so here I can just upload my own photo here. So this is my image. So if you want to change the position, so just click on it. And then you have option here to uncrop or to crop. So just click on crop and then you can move just like that. Or I will just go ahead and click uncrop. 
and you will see this whole image here. And here I can add my text here about me. So let me just delete this one maybe since we already have our big text here or header text. So let me just go ahead and delete that. And here I will just go ahead and add the about me. So let me just go ahead and copy some text here from my notepad. So this text is just for tutorial guys. So, all right, so for example, like that. And as I can see here that our photo is just too big. So let me just go ahead and resize our photo. So I will just click on our photo. And as you can see here, we have these dots. So we can just easily move these dots just to level our text. All right, so something like that. And then I will just go ahead and click crop for me to position our image. So let me position it. All right, so I guess that's better now. And then the next thing that we can do is we can add our text. So we already have our text here. So I will go ahead and enter here services. So this will be your services that you can uh, provide to your client. So as you can see here that our text is on the left side. So you can put this one on the center. Just go ahead and click this align. And then you can select this center. And this text is very small. As you can see here, it's a normal text. You can also change this one as title or heading. So let me just go ahead and select heading. And here we can add our information about our services, something like this, for example. So these are our services. And also down here, I added some testimonial. So you can insert or add the screenshot of your client's feedback about your work. And by the way, guys, before I forget, you can also add some button here. So just click on button and you can add the button. Just name it here, for example, hire me. And then I can also add some link here. So I will link this button to my contact information. Or you can also add some different URL here. For example, your Instagram link or your LinkedIn link. It will depend on you. So just click insert after. And here I will just go ahead and move this one. And I will be adding it here. And then I will move this button over here. So I will just go ahead and drag and drop it here. So as you can see, I have a button here now. So after my client read the information about me, if they want to hire me, then they can just click this hire me button and then they will redirect to my contact information to contact me. So once you're done with your design, you can also check the preview. So just click the preview up here. And here is what your website look like online once it published. So you can also check a different preview here. So for example, for phone view, you can also do that. And you have your menu here. And also you can view it as tablet. And once you're ready to publish, just close this one. And then just click on the publish button up here. And then you can publish your website for free. So for free, you will be having this domain. So if you want to have your own personal domain without this, then you need to buy or purchase your own domain. But for now, I will go ahead and publish and we are done. So I guess that's all for today's video. And if you have any question, guys, just comment down below. And thank you so much for watching.